Hello guys, hello babies, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are doing great today. So today I have, okay, I have an interesting reaction for you all. Let's see what it has to say. Women sports, what many things but can't say. Let's go. I saw a woman a couple months back professional soccer player, right? She goes on to ESPN or one of these sports channels and she starts bitching, going like, I don't understand, how come female athletes don't make as much as male professional athletes? And all of these men had to sit there and act like they didn't know what the answer was. They had to sit there like dumbfounded, like, oh, I don't know, why is that? Uh, Literally, I'm sitting at home screaming at the TV because you don't sell any fucking tickets! Nobody is going to women's soccer games! You're playing in a 20,000 seat arena, 1,500 people show up, that's not a good night! The promoter lost his fucking ass on that gig! I'm not saying no professional female athletes, Serena Williams, the women in the UFC, you know? But nobody's watching your fucking sport. And then you're gonna come and you're gonna get mad at fucking men. They keep doing that shit. Why are you yelling at us? It's not our fucking job. Mm. It's not my fucking job to give a fuck about women's soccer. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Those hearts, because he keeps on using the F word, but I think what he's saying makes a lot of sense, because nobody watched. So how do you expect to make a lot of money from what nobody watched or what nobody subscribed to? That's just it. You can make a lot of money or you can't even make money from what nobody literally watch or pays attention to and that's just it let's continue guys okay i have men's sport to pay attention to this is it's your bullshit right dude look at the wnba nobody in the wnba got covid <laughs> nobody they have been playing in front of three to four hundred people a night for a quarter of a century. Not to mention, it's a male subsidized league. We gave you a fucking league. None of you showed up. Where are all the feminists? None of you, none of you went to the fucking games. None of you, you all, you failed them. Not me, not men. Women failed the WNBA. Ladies, ladies. Name your top five all-time WNBA players of all time. Come on. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Name five WNBA teams. Name the WNBA team in your fucking city. You can't do it. You don't give a fuck about them. In as much as it's being realistic, it's being so harsh. But honestly... I feel if it's so right, it's so right, it's so correct. Cause I feel if women pay attention to their own sports, cause the population of women has so much. So if women pay attention to their own sports, it's going to make their fellow women aim more. And it's going to bring more livelihood to womanhood. So let's go. They play night in and night out in front of nobody. It's a fucking tragedy, right? And then meanwhile, you look at the Kardashians, they're making billions. You know those Real Housewife shows? They're making money hand over fist because that's what women are watching. Yeah. And the money listens. You don't want to watch this shit? You watch this shit? <laughs> they just shoot it over there, drowning these whores. In money, in purses, in shoes, in Botox. It's just raining. True, true, so it's true. Money. Yeah, so just the, the money facts. listens. You'd rather watch that shit. Real Housewives, bunch of women just tearing each other down. Well, maybe that's why your husband left you. Maybe that's why your husband left. That's why you can't have kids. It's been so realistic. Oh my god. Like it literally is literally been so realistic and it's saying the truth. Ah. 
this is so funny but it's so real whatever i'm saying is the fact because all women watches real housewives the kardashians and the rest of it all they some of them even pays attention to z word and all of that and that shit is crazy and those people keep making more money and those athletes they keep asking they keep asking those questions why don't you make much money but women don't pay attention to sports so how do you expect them to make so much money what they pay attention to is what works actually it's bitch that's why your ass is as flat as your titties bitch right that's the message you sent we would rather watch that than see a bunch of women come together as a, as a team and try to achieve a common goal we would rather watch them actually fucking destroy each other this is sad but yeah. so real women rather watch each no, no, other no. destroy and each other end, women you, you guys have to do better we all have to do you better fucking yell at guys like and it's like all right so let me get this straight i have to buy you a drink stop the axe murderer from coming through the fucking window and i have to watch wnba games for you like when are you gonna pick up your end of the couch yeah I don't have, no, I don't have any sympathy for women when it comes to shit like that because every study they've ever done to determine who's smarter, men or women, every study comes back and says women are smarter. Every fucking one. Ladies, you shouldn't be applauding that. You know I'm an asshole. You know this isn't going to end well. Ouch. Ouch. Did he say I'm pretty? Get out of the relationship! <laughs> if every study says that you're smarter, okay? The question you should be asking yourself was, well, we're so goddamn smart, how are we in the situation we're in? Well? <laughs> <laughs> you're in the situation you, you're in. Not because of guys like me. As much as you want to blame me. I'm, yeah, I'm, you know, ladies, you can't tell me. You never drove by a sports bar on a football Sunday and looked at the humanity in there? All those dumb guys with their big beer bellies bumping shit. Hey, it's on my fantasy team! I'm top, man! Want to get some more mozzarella sticks, man? As a woman with your bigger brain, you never looked in there? <laughs> and thought to yourself, I'm fucking losing to that. I'm losing to that. Yeah, there's nothing stopping you other than the fact that you guys are just into destroying each other. That's true. No, now it's going to get quiet. <laughs> I see all that sneaky shit you do. Ladies, if you could just support the WNBA the way you support a fat chick that's proud of her body and is no longer a threat to you, you know, <laughs> that league would be doing better numbers in the NBA. This is crazy. This is so crazy. <laughs> it's so, so real. He just stated fact like for real. If we ladies stop destroying each other and face what we're supposed to face, honestly, things are going to get better for us all. But we keep on destroying each other. We're bent on. They are bent on destroying each other. I'm a woman, but I'm not bent on that. I don't do that. But women are bent on destroying each other. And when they come out, they act like they don't or they didn't do nothing. Like that shit is literally so crazy and annoying. Honestly, we need to do better, act better, honestly. And that is going to help us all. We're going to go far if we keep on doing that. All we care about is destroying each other, like watching different shows, like The Real Housewife, bunch of women, like he said, bunch of women sitting, sitting, destroying each other, saying shitty things to each other, like it's, it's crazy. And that's literally all we care about, and that's not good. We have to do better. Women destroying women. That's 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 literally what's going on in our world today, and we have to do better. We have to do better. So, guys, comment down below what you think about this reaction. Give us a thumbs up. Share to as many as you can to your friends, to your families, and to your loved ones. And please, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. See you guys on our next video.